One of the greatest strengths of machine learning is its ability to infer the underlying structure in the data without having to actually create the models manually. This can come in handy for competitive analysis, for example, when we have data about our competitor, but we don't necessarily know the model behind it. Say you run a company that provides auto insurance for your customers. The premium customers pay is proportional to the risk. The risk is a function of many factors like driver's age, driver's accident history, parked location of the car, etc. For this example, we'll simplify things to better understand the concepts. Let's assume that risk is only a function of the driver's age. If we had competitor data on their customers, specifically the customer's age and the premium each pays, then we can determine the competitor's underlying risk model. You break the data into a training set and a testing set. Then you use a training set to train the machine. There are a number of machine learning algorithms that you could use, but you can pick the one that seeks to reduce the error on the testing set. Say that the machine found the underlying pattern for the competitor data to have a non-linear relationship between risk and age, and here's what it looks like. You can now run the same experiment with your own company's data and say the results look like this. If your expense ratio is comparable to your competitors, then you know that you're capturing the younger and senior segments of the population, and your competitor is capturing the middle age group. With this information, you can make some business decisions on how to penetrate the middle age market. Perhaps you can add more risk factors to this segment to get more accuracy, or perhaps you want to leave it the way it is because you believe that the risk estimation that you're doing is more accurate than your competitors, and if you lower the risk anymore, you'll be losing money on the segment. Note that you will be able to infer what the competitor's risk model is without actually knowing what the model is. While this is the fundamental concept, you can include more parameters from the data to the machine learning algorithm to increase its accuracy and understand your competitors and make business decision that's rooted in data. So this is just the tip of an iceberg, and it's one example of applying machine learning in your organization.